welcome back to Science Made Simple with Dr. Boyd the Chemist. Science Made Simple with Dr. Boyd the Chemist, yo, 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 yo. Science Made Simple with Dr. Boyd the Chemist, yo, 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 ow! Today we are doing three molecules. Today you will need skewers, self candy, including marshmallows, gummy bears, and Twizzlers, and you will also need toothpicks. You'll also probably want to have paper plates as well as paper for labeling. Welcome back. As you can see, I'm on the road today and I'm here with my niece and nephew and we're making replica molecules and we're gonna make today DNA. What's DNA? DNA is genetic information for your body. Okay. It's also what makes you you, so you can inherit stuff from your family because of DNA. Good answers, huh? So, please just follow along. We're gonna use these items, very sweet candy items, and we're gonna make our replica DNA molecule. Hope you enjoy it. What about safety? Well, we shouldn't be poking ourselves, like we shouldn't be playing with these because they're not toys. So you don't want to poke your eyes and that's why you should always have adult supervision with you. All right. And be careful. For the most part, this is very safe. As my niece and nephew have pointed out, we do have skewers that have pointed tips and we have toothpicks. So you do want to be careful not to poke yourself with either of those items and as my nephew has pointed out, you definitely want to do this along with some adult supervision. I also want to mention that we got this idea from Steam Lab for Kids, and I hope I get this name right. I think it's by Liz Lee Heineke. And so that's where we got the idea for today's demonstration. All right, we can get started. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Deoxyribonucleic acid, or DNA for short, is a molecule responsible for carrying the genetic information necessary for life to exist. Its structure was the subject of much debate among scientists for many years before it was finally determined in 1953. The structure of DNA is commonly referred to as a double helix. Basically, it looks like a ladder that is twisted. The rungs on that ladder are made up of nucleobase molecules that come in two different pairs, adenine with thymine or cytosine with guanine. These are commonly referred to as ATGC base pairs. The base pairs fall between a backbone that contains phosphate and the sugar deoxyribose. To make your DNA with candy, First, separate out your candy by color into four groups, representing the four different nucleobases. Pair up your nucleobases into ATGC base pairs using the toothpicks. For the DNA backbone, we are using Twizzlers. Make a ladder of candy lined toothpicks between two Twizzlers. Then twist your candy ladder and you're all finished. Alright, my DNA is done since I can't add another bear skewer. Ta-da! DNA! DNA! Like it? It's weird and it's really hard to hold. I'll go so I can see. Mine isn't. See, I have a stick. That looks like a different... It looks kind of like a drawing. You're supposed to do this. It's like a person being so happy. I love it. Can I eat it now? I want to eat it. Let us eat. And of course, when you're finished, you can eat your DNA. Um, I'm going to eat it like a sheesh kebab. Mm. It was fun while it lasted. <laughs> So I hope you really enjoyed this delicious demonstration. And the best part is when you're done, you can eat it. But you're also learning at the same time. 
Love these kids. So, I hope you had fun with us. I want to thank our Uncle Dale for coming into Kalamazoo. Science made simple. Peace out. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Ah, uh, out. If we can get, if we can roll up those subscribers, that would be great. And you'll get some chocolate. No one <laughs> said that. I'll just say no one said that afterwards. Science made simple. Peace out.